Hello, everybody. Welcome to Monday. I am so glad that you guys are here with us to do our crock pot challenge group. Um, this message will be posted in my group for the uh, Team Got Heart Fitness and in my fellow coaches group. So I want to welcome all of you guys and introduce myself. My name is Melissa Pfeiffer Herman. I am a Beachbody coach um, and I belong to the Team No Limits Fitness um, along with many of my fellow coaches who have been working with you guys on this uh, week's group and putting together the fabulous shopping list and meal plan and all of the things that we're going to be doing throughout this week. I'm glad you guys have been participating the last couple of days in our prep. Um, we've done shopping so far, we've done some meal preps, we've looked at our lifestyle and our goals and some fitness ideas, um, and we will be adding in some more things now throughout this week as we go with the menu that has been posted and a lot of the information that we've shared so far. Um, but I wanted to start today off with some focus and some motivation. Um, to let you guys know where you're at, where we're at, and where we're going together. So, first of all, I want to talk about setting our intentions. Um, this is very important, why we start the week off the way that we do. Monday is a very important day to be able to focus because it's a little overwhelming. We've got a lot of stuff we know throughout our work weeks and our family responsibilities that kind of come at us and we're laying it all out. We've done some prep work on the weekend and today we're going to set our intention on following through with what we started and picking up the pieces as we go because that's the other kind of part of this, is that it's not gonna be perfect. It's not gonna be flawless. We're gonna be in the kitchen and go, oh my gosh, I don't have enough of this, or I may have forgotten something there, or this didn't work the way I wanted it to. You know, it, things happen. So we need to be okay with that as we go and not give up. Biggest, biggest rule. As we run into obstacles or challenges, as we may feel a little overwhelmed, maybe something in our schedule didn't work the way that we had planned for the week, we kind of become resourceful. We'll pick up with where we are, we'll go with what we have, and we'll continue to move on. So I wanna talk about learning where we're going, learning as we're going, um, learning together, learning from our mistakes and our successes, um, growing together. We're going to kind of get some growing pains as we go through this, and meal planning in itself is a little overwhelming. So it's okay as we kind of get started to feel that way, that's normal. Um, I know when I first started the Beachbody uh, lifestyle and I would do my weekend meal planning, I had to write everything out until it became second nature. Now I know what I'm doing daily. It's part of a habit. It, within a couple of weeks, it became natural and I've been able to maintain it for over a year and a half now. So this is something that is doable. You can move into these routines and then we stretch and we grow. I will tell you, Cooking is not my greatest forte. Um, I need fast, easy, uh, simple things to process. Um, the more that I have to put together, the more overwhelmed I get. So Crock-Pot is great when I can throw it all together and I can get going and be on my way. That's easy. Um, sometimes I have to stop and slow down and think about what am I adding? Why am I doing what I'm doing? and really get myself focused for a short time so I know that in the long run, it's gonna be easier. So I'm gonna have some growing pains, some, some challenges as I go along. I know as I work with some of the new recipes, um, I like, again, creature of habit to use what I've always done. So when I take on something new, I know I've gotta give myself a little bit of grace. That's a biggie, so give yourself grace. Um, Share as we go. Share your challenges. Share your victories. If you have an aha, if you're like, oh, I didn't have enough of this, but I tried this instead, share that. Um, that is resourceful. Remember, we want to stay clean with what we're eating. Um, looking for the preservatives, for the additives, anything like that, don't use it. Use your, your best, cleanest, wholest foods that you can find. Um, if you have food sensitivities, you know, exchanging one for, thing for another, that's the kind of stuff we want you to share. If you maybe run short on one particular ingredient and you find another one that's just as healthy or maybe even a better superfood or something that you want to try instead, fantastic. Share those things with us and encourage yourselves, encourage each other, cheer each other on. I, I know it sometimes feels a little corny 
when we first start this out, especially if before we have a relationship where we're going in and saying, yay, great job, hooray. But really, it helps us to develop relationships with each other. And it will help you to feel the connection of contribution with your fellow teammates. And as you move forward and join other future groups or become um, closer with some of these friends of yours now, uh, you will find that that encouragement goes a very long way. And their encouragement to you will go a long way. So when you add value to somebody else, when you invest in them, it helps to bring up the entire spirit. So real quick review. It's Monday, we're gonna set our minds straight, we're gonna focus on what we're doing, we're gonna plan out, we're gonna move forward as we go, we're gonna set our times as we need to, but then we're gonna be uh, supportive and encouraging, share as we grow and give ourselves grace. If something comes up, it's okay, pick up, move forward, be resourceful and enjoy. That's what this is all about. So I thank you guys so much for being a part of our group. I wish you a wonderful Monday. Hurrah, hooray, and let's do this.